Hey, welcome to the All-Star channel. Today I want to show you what I use to drive my cars. Uh, I use two different methods now. Hopefully the wind's not messing up the mic here. And I'm not paid to uh, show you this product. I'm just going to tell you about it. I actually found it by chance at Harbor Freight. I was looking at drying towels, and if you're familiar, there's something called a waffle weave towel. And they work good for drying. I've been using them for years. But the problem I find is they uh, saturate, they soak up the water, and you're constantly wringing the thing out. So I was at Harbor Freight, and I found this. It's called a Grant's Premium XL Plus Drying Towel. What's their part number? Uh, stock number, I don't know, it doesn't say on here. Oh, there it is, 64312. So anyway, like I say, I'm not paid to do this. I bought two of them. I think it was like seven bucks. I got one out here and I have used it. And usually the waffle weaves, you gotta get them wet before they'll actually absorb, if you know what I'm talking about. But let me show you this thing. I'm gonna zoom in right there. I just got done now. I don't normally dry this car. If you got a higher end car, you probably wanna use this right here. I use the old leaf blower electric leaf blower and I'll leave a link to one of these down below but hopefully you can see this uh, water on here the thing soaking wet I'm gonna go a little tighter there we go this thing is dry now the only problem I have with it is it's so big that um, I'm gonna probably cut it in half but watch this this is amazing now I just set it on there and as I drag it across and now I'm not pushing down so I'm not scratching the paint of course make sure it's clean look at that I don't know if you can see it, I'll bring the camera in tighter. But just running it over like that, this thing is dry here. Let's check it out. Let me uh, get you off the tripod. Look at this. I'll try to hold the camera steady as I can here. But look at that. Look how that works. Here's, here's a spot here. I'll try to get the sun behind it. I'm just gonna run this right across. And like I say, I'm not even pushing down. I'm just letting this float on here. And I use this pretty much for, you know, any other uh, special car I want to wash. I'll call it that. But the thing is fantastic. Let me give you uh, and of course, never set your towel down on the ground. If this thing hits the ground, uh, it's time to clean it up and get it done that way. You don't want to have grit and grime into the paint. So here's my leaf blower action. And I've posted a video of this like on Instagram, but this door is all wet. Let's give it a little blow action. So I hope that gave you some insight on how to dry the car. I'm going to put my shades on, not to look cool. Well, to look cool and to keep that sun back there out of my eyes uh, so I can see the camera anyway. This towel works fantastic. Look how big this thing is. You can always, you know, wear it as a robe. You could probably uh, shower with it, you know, dry yourself off when you get out. It's pretty big. I'm probably going to cut it in half. It is hemmed on the edges, but it's soft. And... Uh, like I say, I think this thing's like seven, eight bucks, and I'm not even sure if that's what their Harbor Freight coupon. The best way is to use that leaf blower action. Those are like $40, $50 for a good one, and that way you're not touching the paint. Anytime you touch the paint, you can scratch, you have a, a chance to scratch the paint, and that's something you don't want to do. So thanks for stopping by. Check me out on Instagram, it's OzStar1. Please smash that like button if you thought the video was helpful. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you on the next one. Take it easy.